the Collins Creatures. I'm at the Otuna Reptile Show with a massive beaded lizard. And while it is common to see Gila monsters at shows, not so much beaded lizards, especially one that's full size and has a temperament like this guy. So I'm going to check out the show, see all the really cool creatures, and why don't you come along? This Arizona mountain king snake is really cool. These tiny lizards are full grown. This is a cave clawed scorpion. They are a large scorpion from Africa that are deep black and have long claws. And they used to be related to the emperor scorpion in the genus Pandinus, but now they have their own genus Pandipalpus. And because they are a large black scorpion, the cave clawed scorpion is one of our creature features of the show. Rosy boas are one of two boa species native to the United States. Yeah, that one is super pretty. I really like the huge spot he has on his nose there. You might need a glass of milk after all these hot snakes. This is an Obi Island water monitor. They are from Indonesia and are a subspecies of the Asian water monitor that gets around three and a half feet, while the normal Asian water monitor gets around eight to nine feet. They have the cool pattern as babies, like the Asian water monitor, and are basically like the Asian water monitor, but in a smaller package. And because it is a smaller version of the Asian water monitor and looks really cool, the Obi Islands water monitor is one of our creature features of the show.
This green amoeba is really cool looking and I'll have to look up more about them. There's nothing to compare them against in the shot, but these are adult red-eared sliders. This is a snowflake dumpy frog. They're also known as white tree frogs and they're from Australia. And they're called snowflake because on their back they have these white dots that get bigger as they grow that look like snowflakes. And they come in different colors. This one is brown, they can also be green. And they are a very large frog that is also very docile and one of the best beginner frogs. So because it is an awesome looking frog that has the snowflakes and is quite docile, and apparently can walk backwards, the Snowflake Dumpy Frog is one of our creature features of the show. This is a breedable pair of captive bred painted agamas. While they have scorpion in the name, whip scorpions are completely harmless and you can hold them, and they'll also get much bigger than this. This is an anery mangrove snake. They are from Southeast Asia and are the longest species of cat snake in the world, getting six to seven feet long. And they are rear fang venomous, and if you were bitten, there would be severe swelling and pain where you were bitten, but there has been no recorded deaths due to a mangrove snake bite. And it is a really beautiful snake. Normally, they are black with yellow rings, but this one is an anery, so there is no yellow. And because it is an awesome looking snake that gets really large, the anery mangrove snake is one of our creature features of the show.
He noticed the camera was rolling, so he struck a pose. Will the owner of the banana yellow reticulated python please claim your baggage? This is a scorpion mud turtle. Scorpion mud turtles are from Mexico, Central America, and South America. And they, like most mud turtles, they're a fairly small species. And this one is pretty cool because it's hard to see, but the center line of scoots is kind of diamond shaped around the larger side scoots. Because it's a small turtle that has a cool scoot pattern, the scorpion mud turtle is one of our creature features of the show. This crusty was the most expensive one at the show, and it reminds me of s'mores. I'm surprised he's staying there. You may have to pause the video to actually see the leaf gecko. This is a baby blood python. I had a great time at the Altoona Reptile Show and saw lots of really cool animals. And I hope you enjoyed the show too. So thanks for watching. Subscribe to my channel, like my videos, and I'll see you next time on Collins Creatures.